name? Alicia. Same last name? Yep. Age? She just turned 16 two months ago. So 16. Yes. Height, weight? Five foot two, 110 pounds. Hair, eye color? Uh, short locks with uh, light streaks in the back. Two cream, one sugar. Thank you. What was she wearing at the time of her disappearance? Uh, here. My youngest found this on the Just describe her outfit, please. Blue hoodie, short cutoffs, chucks, converse. Did you want the photo? Is this the last one that was taken of her? Yes. No. Here, I'll send it to myself. <sighs> Any birthmarks, tattoos, distinctive characteristics? Yeah, a mole on the upper part of her right hand arm. All right. Now what? We'll enter this into the system, and our officers out on patrol will keep an eye out for her. That's it? Nine times out of ten, girls run off to be with their boyfriends because they had a fight with their mother and they want to teach her a lesson. We didn't fight. And we find them right away. I wouldn't worry too much. Well, what about the one time? The one time out of ten? We're not there yet. Most runaways are found within 72 hours. And the ones that aren't? Rehearsal in 30 minutes. You need a ride? No, I'm meeting with Sharinda and Lala. Okay. Bye, bitch. Whatever, bitch. Hey. <laughs> what? We said bitch. Hey, hey, hey. Love you. I love you, too. Hey. Okay. 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 Yeah. okay. You got it. You got it. I see you, little sis. Oh, my. You promised to give me more privacy when we move. And look at all this privacy. You have an entire bedroom to yourself. And you're still not happy. Alicia, what's wrong? Nothing. I mean, you could go outside and make some new friends. But I like my old friends. Yeah, but everyone makes new friends in high school. But I did, and now I have to start all over. Tate sucks. Yeah, but it's better than McCallum. Do you know why we moved here? For opportunities for you. I mean, are you gonna spend the rest of your vacation pouting? Come here, baby girl. Mm. Everything sucks. Yeah, but it gets better. I promise. But you always say that. I know, because it's always right. <laughs> I love you. I love you too, Mom. <sighs> You can let Mrs. Yu know that she can come in Friday at 10. We'll get her cleaning done first, and then we'll do her husband afterwards. Everyone will be done by noon. If you could just call her and let her know. Thank you. Oh, this thing is getting on my last nerves. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you play too much. You worry too much. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Help me, please. <laughs> Are you tired? Uh, yes, yes, um, there's a new girl that started today, and, um, you have to get used to that drive. Yeah. Okay. okay. Password. What you feeling? Um, 062808. Babe. It has to be something I can remember. <laughs> Girls good? Yeah, um, you know, Katie's great. Leisha is leashing. <laughs> Are they asleep? Uh, they should be. It's late. Good. There. You? Well, you know what a new house means, right? You know what a new house means? Oh, like our first house. Oh. Every room? Oh, yeah. And I can keep on dreaming. Hey!
Mom bought that for you? Should I change? I'll go change. That ass. Stop it. Alicia, I want to introduce you to someone in a second. Mom. If anyone bothers you, you know what will happen. They'll catch hands? These hands. Well, for real. You always. Okay. <laughs> um, hey. Come, come, come. Uh, Tamara. Hi. This is Alicia. Alicia, this is Tamara. Um, hey. Tamara goes to Tate, and I met her mom at the mailbox. So I thought that you two. <laughs> Up. Hey, Hi. sorry, she's so extra. Mine too. <laughs> Where were you supposed to go to school? Uh, McCallum. Oh, McCallum's whack as hell. <laughs> hey, can I invite some friends over? Your daddy's ribs are fire. Sure. <laughs> Sweet. Looks like someone's made a few friends. <laughs> oh my goodness, thank God. <laughs> Who's the young man? I met his mom at orientation. I think his name is Kai. Uh, oh. Oh. Uh, oh. She looks happy. Yeah. That's right. Oh! <laughs> all right, now. Here we go. Woo! All right, you know what time it is all up in here. Come here, Mom. Here we go, Fred. It's all right, y'all. Just yeah, keep yeah. going, Agnes. We got this. Yeah. Officers, how y'all doing tonight? Been better. Sorry to hear that. But there's a plate of ribs and my wife's potato salad with your names on it. <laughs> I'll pass. Vegetarian. So, what can we do for you tonight? We got not one, not two, but three noise complaints in the past hour. Oh, uh, my bad. We'll absolutely turn the music down, not a problem. Mm-hmm. Did you clear this little get-together with your homeowners association? Come again? Yes. With a gathering this big and a bunch of cars parked on the street, you need to clear it with the homeowners association in advance. It's good to know. Appreciate you. Shut it down. Right. Last chance on that barbecue. Grandfather's secret recipe. It's not a secret if you know it. Y'all have a good night. That seems bold. It's, it's, it is. Okay. <laughs> All right. Sorry I have to cut this short. Why can't I go? Wait, you're the one who said I need to go out more. I need to make new friends. Alicia, but you are a sophomore, and tailgating is for grown folks. No, but that's what they do at Tate after football games. Yeah, but there could be drinking and drugs. Oh, seriously? Mom, <laughs> do I do any of those things? Uh, and now is not a good time to start. You could trust me. I do trust you. It's other people that I don't trust. But Tamara gets to go. And Tamara is fast, and you're not Tamara. Fine. I'll just die miserable, a loser, and alone. <laughs> really? <laughs> okay, how about this? How about you have some friends over Friday night, you have a sleepover, and you have pizza, and ice cream, and you binge watch whatever, I mean, I know it's not a tailgate, but I think it'd be fine. Fine. <laughs> don't hurt me. I won't hurt oh, you. Okay. I don't plan. Oh my. Okay. Oh, oh. oh my God. Hey, ladies. <laughs> Hi. Well, I just wanted to uh, check in on you guys and see if you needed anything before I turn it in. 
Mm, we're okay. And my mom says hi. Well, tell her I said hi. I will. <laughs> okay, well, ladies have fun. Good night, Mom. Good night. Bye. Night, Bye. Mom. Is it cute? It's super cute. <laughs> do, you, do you have a mirror? What's going on right now? Uh, girl, we're not missing the first tailgate of the year. So we're sneaking out? Yeah, what do you have cute to wear? I, I can't. My mom... We sneak out, we sneak back in, your mom will never know. That's how sneaking out works. Ty's gonna be there. And he told JJ, who told me that he thinks you're super cute. <laughs> Did he really say that? Yeah, he really said that. Should we get an outfit on? Yeah, okay. Yeah, Come on. Let's okay. Take something out. Uh, okay. Um, okay. <laughs> Three tries. When you set it off, I'm a laugh. You're gonna be grounded till the day you die. Bet. <laughs> what was it? My birthday. Let's go. <laughs> Come here, I'll show you some. He's gonna get that deep. <laughs> oh. Sorry, I thought we were cool. We are. I just, I have to go home. I screwed up. You wanna ride? No, I'm okay. you but are you lost yeah I just moved here and my phone's dead and I get turned around at night well, get in I'll give you a ride home no I, I, sh I shouldn't I know you're not supposed to ride with strangers my name's Lori good to meet you and it's late I know I, I just don't want some shady guy throwing you into his van <laughs> okay thanks for the ride now, where are we going? With a nine-month-old, you know I got snacks for days. Thank you, Costco. <laughs> Turn right. Thank you so much. Not a problem. You're on my way home anyway. So, how long have you lived here? Just a few weeks. Oh, then of course you got lost. Well, I could have called my mom, but I'm not supposed to be out, so. <laughs> Been there. What's your mom do? She's a dental hygienist at Scadden Dentistry. Brothers, sisters? A sister. Cadence. She's three years younger than And what's your dad do? He's a night shift manager. He got this really big promotion, so we moved. Oh, uh, new school, new friends. Boyfriend? I don't know. Maybe. I, I think I might have just pissed him off, though. Ah, uh, it's hard to be a kid these days. Turn right. Oh. You all right? Yeah, just um, dizzy all of a sudden. Just relax. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Hey, uh, you missed your. T <laughs> no, I gotta go. I said relax. I gotta go.
Ladies, breakfast. Coming. Okay. Where's Lisha? Upstairs. Oh, you ladies have a fight last night? Mm. No. Okay, well, I will go get her. Okay. <laughs> Mom? What's going on? Where is your sister? Hey, it's Alicia. You know what to do. She's still not answering. You want me to call her again? Yes. Hey, it's Alicia. You know what to do. Hey, Alicia. ST. Call your mom back as soon as you get this, okay? She's worried. Bye. Maybe her battery died. You said that you saw her leave with Ty. And that was the last time you saw her? Yes. And you didn't see her again for the rest of the night, none of you? No. Let me read those messages again. Okay, let's go. Where are we going? To Ty's. You too. We'll find her. People don't just go missing. It doesn't, like, happen here, ever. She probably just got lost or fell asleep or... Shut up, T. Should have given her a ride. <sighs> what did he say? He said he saw her walking down Maricopa at midnight last night. He could have given her a ride. Or she could have just called me, or you could have told me that she snuck out, Katie. I know. Sorry, Mom. <sighs> okay, where, where was that parking lot? Can I help you? Multiple noise complaints. Grandpa's not so secret recipe. That's us. What can I do for you? We need to file a missing persons report. Our daughter, she didn't make it home last night from a party. Okay. Need you to fill this out. Please, this is an emergency. How old is she? 16. Last night was only a few hours ago. Try calling her, call her friends, boyfriend. Yeah. We've well, called everyone. No one's seen her. It's barely 10 a.m. I'm sure you haven't called everyone. Didn't you folks just move here? Officer, she's a minor. Yeah, but not a minor minor. Look, if your daughter were, say, five and ran off in the middle of the night, I'd be worried. But I've been doing this for nearly as long as she's been alive. And this happens all the time. Parents panic, they file a report. 
And in a few hours, he or she is found at a friend's house with movies and some such, which means the precious resources of the police department have been wasted on what we call a mistaken report. It's a drain on our budget. So you won't help us? 99% of cases resolve themselves within 24 hours. If you haven't found her by then, we'll issue an APB and get the whole department on it. Until then, I can't help you. Look, I'm sure if you two put your heads together, there are half a dozen places you haven't looked, and that's where she'll probably be. Thank you, officer. Yeah, thank you. You are in the house. Whose house? My house. I'm Ron, by the way. Good to meet you. I think there's been some kind of mistake. I'm not supposed to be here. I, I really, really need to go home. You have a little sister, right? <laughs> Cadence, was it? How did you know that? You told Lori, Lori told me. A regular little chatterbox, aren't you? <laughs> See, now, if I let you go... I might have to go grab Cadence. Do you want me to do that? No. Good. I just think that there's been some kind of mistake. No, I... no mistake. You went out looking for trouble. No, no, I did it. I did it. I did just it. Just like that? Yeah, you did. No. <laughs> right now, you need to just sit and listen. Can you do that? Yes. Good. I... I'm a businessman. That's it. That's what I do. This is not a prison. It's a business. And you are a valued employee, an investment. I have five other girls who are also valued employees. They come and go as they like. They make money. They have privileges. You are no different than any of them. <laughs> you... You locked me in here. <laughs> Because you and I have not established trust. You do what you're told, keep your mouth shut, earn your keep, we won't have a problem. If you can't do those things, we will. It's very simple. What do I have to do? Well, you want to act grown. What we do here is grown folk stuff. <laughs> believe this is happening. I just can't believe it. Where is she? We'll find her. And the cops. The cops. They won't help us. They never help us. I mean, a little black girl goes missing and they assume that it's drugs or that she ran away. What are we gonna do? We're gonna look. We're gonna keep calm. We're gonna find God is good. Father, Father Nevin, please look over our family. Please, Lord. Watch out for us. Okay. What about this one? Oh, yeah, that'll be good. Right? Yeah. Susan, our daughter's missing. Have you seen her? She's, she's missing. And... So if you see her, you know, because the, the cameras that you have right here, she might have walked in this area. Please. <laughs> Come on. Stop. Cries too much. How am I supposed to get her lashes on? Hi. Fix your face, or I'll have Ron fix it for you. 
Destiny, come here. Bring something for the new girl. Get it together, newbie. You know that gun Ron carries? He'll use it. Especially if I tell him to. Now quit all that crying with your stupid ass. Give her something. <laughs> We're gonna log in, all right? Here we go. Call me princess. 18, thick thighs, tight booty, sexy, sweet, barely legal. Will you be my daddy? Lisha? It's me, Dee. Anything? No one's seen her. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. All right, it's been 24 hours, so we can go back to the police station, have them start looking for her, and then maybe we do another check of the old neighborhood. All right. Okay. <sighs> name? Alicia. Same last name? Yep. Age? She just turned 16 two months ago. So 16. Yes. Height, weight. Five foot two, 110 pounds. If anyone has her, please don't hurt her. She's everything to us. Please let her go. You have that power. Let her come home. Um. To our baby girl. We love you so much. And then we are out here every day, every hour looking for you. And I want to make this promise right now before God. We are going to bring you home. We're going to bring you home. The client pays me downstairs, I send him upstairs, and all you have to do is whatever they tell you. Smile. Be friendly. So what was that? Hmm. Exactly. Grown folks' business. And then when they're done, they come back down and they report to me, and that report better be good, or you and I are going to have a problem. Sit tight. First one will be easy. <laughs> Princess? Hey, sweetie. Why don't we get a little closer? Hey, you have a good time? You and me? <sighs> uh, 
Have you slept? No, I, I will sleep when she's back. Damn here, it. here, here. Hey. Yeah. I gotta go in for a few hours tonight, okay? My boss wants me to check on a few things. It shouldn't take long. Unbelievable. If I lose my job, we're in some kind of way. And it'll be a hell of a thing for Alicia to come back to. Okay, Curtis. Are you sure you two didn't fight? No, no, me and Leisha were just fine the last time I saw her. You were just fine? Why did she sneak out? I don't know. I mean, that's what teenagers do. <sighs> Is that what they do? It's what you did. Hope to God she's mad at us, Dean. Why would you want to be mad at us? Because if she isn't, then somebody... Hey, somebody's got her. No, right? no, 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 no. We're not... Mm -mm. We're not doing that. We're gonna find her. We're gonna find her. Uh, this is Dana. Hi, Dana. My name is Nancy. I'm the spokeswoman for a support group of parents of missing children, and I have one of your daughter's flyers here. Have you found her yet? No. If you ever need someone to talk to, we meet every <laughs> that Thursday. That won't be necessary. Uh, we, we're gonna find her. Of course. I'll text you my number, yeah. Justin. Mom? Yeah. How long have you been up? I don't think you should be driving. Katie, hush. Your sister's out there somewhere. She could be cold. She could be hungry. How could I not look for her? I would look for you, and I can sleep when she's home. Okay. Just slow down. Wait, is that... Is that her? Mom, Mom I think that's her hoodie. Stay in the car. Lock the doors. Alicia! Mom, wait! Hey, stay in the car! Alicia! 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 What do you want from me? Leave me alone! I'm sorry. What do you want from me? Okay. Family, keep your head down. Shut up. Play the game. And eventually, eventually, you'll do what men always do: get cocky and slip up. That's when we get the hell out of here. Can it? Think so? Don't think. You gotta know. Because if you do something real stupid, like jump before it's time to jump, that gun's not gonna show. No. He'll kill me. He'll kill me. He'll disappear you. Which is worse? Okay, you're gonna be smart. Give him everything. But if you're extra friendly and someone tips you a little more, skim it. You're gonna need it for when you bust out of here. Now shower, get dressed, try not to look too miserable. We get burgers on Sundays. And here, Lori has plenty. It'll take the edge off if it gets too bad. Did he disappear? Did he disappear someone you knew? The girl who told me to be smart. She got me through some bad stuff. What was her name? Ron called her Echo. I think her real name is Amy. That's me. I'm scared to see you. Hey. 
perfect timing. Any word? No. How long did you let me sleep for? Like since yesterday when I brought you home from the hospital? You collapsed, remember? I'm fine. Hey, you haven't been sleeping or eating. I thought we agreed that today would be a rest day. What? Alicia is still out there. We have to go. Dana. What? Come here. Stop. Just stop. Come here. Curtis, we have to go. Okay, 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 fine. We'll go. We'll go. But first, have something to eat and take a shower, okay? We'll find her. But not if you run yourself into the ground. Okay. It's been two weeks. Why are you saying it like that? We still have places left that we haven't looked. We... We'll continue our search here. We just need to prepare you... For... A negative outcome. <laughs> what happens... when... Dana? What happens when they find a body? The coroner takes it to the morgue. I have a number. I know how this sounds, but it makes sense for you to call and check in every now and then, just in case. So what do we do now? The same thing you've been doing? I know how hard this is for you and your family. We'll call you if we hear anything. You know what? I know you all have given up on her, but that's my daughter out there, and I'm not giving up on her. She's out there, so all we have to do is find her. Princess. <laughs> Let's have some fun, baby. Come on. getting them. I just hate giving them because that's my money out of my pocket back to someone else. Isn't that a bitch? I, I can explain. How many times did you hit him? A few. Just a few? Maybe several. <laughs> okay. Okay, come on. I understand. You know, sometimes these guys... <laughs> here for Katie. And God bless you with two daughters. I know. Then why are you neglecting the one who's right in front of you? 
Go take a shower. You can pick Katie up from rehearsal for a change. Ago. I have a solo. I was rehearsing it, which you would have known if you even bothered to talk to me. Don't do this again. No, you don't do this again, Mom. I am not the problem. What did you just... Who do you think you're talking to? You quit your job. You sleep all day. You drive around all night. That's not freaking normal. I lost her, too. Cadence. Cadence. Hey. Can I please just ride home with Lala? This is Nancy. Hello? Hi. This is Dana. Um you called me a few months ago when my daughter went missing. Yeah, I just, um, I, I just, I need someone to talk to. It's too quiet in my house. When she was there, there was always singing and dancing. And, but now, all I do is cry. I, I'm either crying or driving. I just can't say goodbye. Because there's no Bobby, you know? It's just this empty space. And my husband and I, we barely even talk. So that's why I'm here. It's been 98 days without her. How many times do you call the morgue a week? Usually two. That's what I used to do. Then I just started going by, bringing them lunch. I got to know everyone by name. This morning, I got a lead. What is that? You post page. It's a website. It's worth checking if you have the time. Sometimes girls who have fallen off the radar, they turn up in the adult section. Sweets for the sweets. Afternoon, ladies. Hey. Hello, handsome. I gotta go here. I'll be right back. Come here. You need to eat more. We're getting too skinny. Getting out of here soon. Once Ron and Lori start trusting your ass, they'll think about adding a new girl. It'll be the perfect time. Unless you slip up and go off again. How much money you got saved up? A few hundred. Okay. Well, I have a thousand. I can float us both, no problem. I can't with this anymore. It's my fault. Maybe I deserve this. No one deserves this. People are allowed to make mistakes. What if my dad finds out mm -mm. what I've been doing with my mom? Mm -mm, mm -mm. The whole hate will stop you think too much. Yeah. Just for you.
found her. She's alive. She's alive. She's alive. What? What's wrong? First off, we don't even know when those were taken. It could have been a week or a month ago. They could have moved her to a different location. There's a number on the ad. Call and find out. I'd advise against that. We don't want to put her in any danger. What? You want to help us? Why won't you help us? This is huge. And how is this even legal? These pictures, I mean, this, is, this can't even be legal. I mean, she's clearly a child. If Alicia ran away from home... Wait, wait you think she, she ran could... away from home to go do this? To go be princess? That's not our daughter. She's being forced. That's the only explanation that makes any damn sense. I'd agree, which means someone took the time to snatch her off the street, take these photos, and use them to try to, like... You mean pimp her out? Jesus. Which means if we intervene without taking the proper precautions... They might try to hurt her. Exactly. We're going to pass this up the chain. I think there's a high probability that there's a trafficking ring in the area. You mean to tell me I moved my family from a bad neighborhood into a nicer neighborhood, but, but with a sex trafficking ring in my backyard? We need resources. There could be a drug ring connected to it. There could be girls coming in from out of state, which means we have to pass it along to the feds. Yeah, but she doesn't look good. She looks sick. I know you're worried. If she was my daughter, I'd be worried, too. Yeah, but she's not your daughter. She's mine. And at the end of the day, I am responsible for her. Look, we'll be in touch. Unbelievable. Unfriggin' believable. for over an hour. No, this is about pictures of my teenage daughter on your website. No, 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 don't, 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 don't put me on hold. Damn it. This is Officer Pfeiffer. Please leave a message. I don't understand. Dana. Why is it taking so long for them to do their job? It has been weeks, and there has been nothing. What do you want to do? I don't know. There is a number. But they said, don't call, because I might make it worse. I have half the mind to buy her back myself. Dana. Hello? Hi. Hi, Mom. Alicia. Alicia. Hi. Where are you? Where are you? I'm, I'm gonna come get you right now. I can't. I'm sorry. No, 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 baby girl. You can. You can. Just tell me where you are. I, I'm gonna come right now. Princess. Where are you at? I heard you look bad. do their job. Yeah, but for how long? And when have the cops ever done their job for us? We're just regular folks, Dee. Yeah, I know, but you didn't, you didn't hear what I heard. She's hurting, and she's afraid, and she's, she's scared. I heard a man beating on her. We can do this. We can do this. All we have to do is we call and we order her services, just like the ad says. That's all we gotta do. What if we blow it? What if we make things worse? I mean, what if Lisha gets hurt? And yeah, then I Lisha can't wait hurt? anymore. I can't. Look, I, 
I, I just don't. Let, let, let me let me think about it. I got to get to work. Okay, well you do that. And while you're out there working, you think about our little girl working. Don't. And then you tell me, how do we just sit here and wait for the cops? Just, just give me some time, all right? <laughs> what are you What are you doing? I'm calling and calling. Ron's picking Lily up for some dude's house. I don't know when we'll get another chance. He's gonna hurt my sister. He's gonna hurt Katie in this place. God damn it, Alicia. Just go. No, go. No, just go. No, come on. Go. Come on. You can't leave me. Come on, I love you. Okay? We made a plan. Go, go. You're gonna be okay. No, no, no. Just go. No, no, no. Just go. I'm just checking in. My wife said she called you a few times. I've been meaning to call her back. It's just that. Things have been really busy around here. With our case? Operations like this can take months, years even. Years? No, 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 no. Mother, you can't please, wait. Please, to... I understand. Curtis, please. She needs help now. I wish that I had better news for you. This isn't going to resolve itself anytime soon. You know I appreciate you. I respect you. Part of me, this is, it was my idea to move here. I was even home the night she was taken. So, so you tell me, what do you, you think I should do? Just wait and let you do your thing? I was picked up when I was 14 on my way to school. I was held for nine months and three weeks. I'm so sorry to hear that. I had no idea. Most people don't know this. Officer Lustig doesn't even know. As someone who was trafficked, what do I think you should do? Whatever it takes. Hey, Katie, 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 come here, come here, come here. Come talk to me. How are things? Fine. Fine? That's it? I have another performance coming up next month. <laughs> well, go you. Grandma said you'd take me. Well, you know, your dad and I, we want to come. We wouldn't miss it for anything. It's OK. I know you've been busy with trying to get Alicia home. Uh, hold on, hold on. Sit, sit right here. I am so proud of you. You have handled this better than anyone in the family. Is Alicia coming home soon? Yeah. Soon. Come on, give me a hug. You know what we need? We need ice cream. All of the ice cream. All the ice cream. Right now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All of it. <laughs> Hi, Dad. Hey, baby girl. Hey. Uh, you know what? I'll bring it up in, in a second. OK. You're right. And I'm with you. You are. Let's go get her. Oh my god. Please, please, no! in there! I'm, I'm sorry! I'm sorry! We are well past sorry. I have told you girls time and time again. Do not test me! I'm sorry! Now! Get your ass upstairs! <laughs> what happened? I made it over the state line, but I guess I needed a fix. <laughs> I guess Ron had some people looking for me. 
because he caught up with me, just like he said he would. Mm -hmm. Alicia, what? It was so good to get out, to not be here. You have no idea. <laughs> It's like you lose yourself here, but when you're out, you get yourself back. And <laughs> I know it sounds stupid, but <laughs> he said he'd kill me if I ran again. But next time I will be smarter, faster, and so will you. <laughs> You don't belong here. I need to just stay. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to stay. Okay, you ready? No. What do I say? Okay, okay. I I, I will call. Uh, yeah. All right, put it on speaker. Put it on speaker. This is Ron. Isn't this a damn beautiful day? Hello? Um, I... My husband and I saw an ad of yours on the you post page for a girl named Princess. Oh, one of my best girls. She's 18, clean, and up for anything. <laughs> so, you two looking to spice things up? Hello? Yeah, um... It's my husband and I's anniversary, and we're looking to try something different. I'm, so I'm sorry, we haven't done this before. Is this a, uh, you watch him and the girl situation? Or maybe he watches the two ladies, or all three of you get into the mix together? I don't know. I, um, we are hoping to bring her to the house, if, if possible. House calls are extra. Yeah, that's fine. All righty then. Let's call it an even five for the first hour, and... An extra bill for every 30 after that. Um, 5,000? <laughs> Boy, you are new. Uh, no. 500. Now you're gonna wanna write this down. Yeah, go ahead. <sighs> okay. Okay, okay, okay. <sighs> what time is it? Um, 7.43. Throw fully at me. Uh, damn it. What? Five all. What are they doing? What are they doing? Oh, they're going, they're going, they're going, they're going. Okay. Okay. Oh, here comes the boss. Okay, okay. 